Lee Phillips again. I want to talk about emergency power supplies. Uh, Christy needs power. We need it for a number of reasons. One, we need it for the baby monitor. So what we did is we got a big computer backup system and we just keep it on the floor along with all the other junk on this side of the bed. The emergency power supply will instantly kick in when the main power goes off. It sounds an alarm and the alarm starts going off as soon as it starts running but it will maintain her equipment for about an hour. So we have the emergency power supply plugged into it. We have an extension cord which goes to that side of the bed and we put the BiPAP that she uses every night on that side of the bed plugged into the emergency power supply so that if the power goes off she is okay. She can't reach up and pull it off of her nose or anything anymore. So it's critical that we have that go on uh, instantly when the power does go off. She can't get her arms out from under the cover. She can't get her arms up high enough to get it off of her face. So with the mask on and no air coming in, she's going to suffocate pretty fast. So we have to have the emergency power supply. We have the baby monitor plugged into it. And we also have the doorbell plugged into it. Ah, the doorbell. That's another YouTube video. So get an emergency power supply. You can get them at the computer stores. They run a couple of hundred bucks. Our son happens to be a computer guy. Every family has one. And so he got it for us. And we just use it there as the emergency power supply. But that's an important thing uh, when you have an ALS person and they're dependent upon the air. We do have backup batteries for the <coughs> excuse me for the uh, trilogy. I'll talk about that. If the power goes out for more than an hour or it's just not a glitch, it's really out, then we're going to have to go to the trilogy and we're going to have to go. Uh, we have two batteries for the trilogy. We can run it about 12 hours, they say. Now I do have a generator in the house uh, and I have more gas than I'm legally supposed to have in the house. I could run the generator for a couple of months. So we could take care of our power needs, but it'd take an hour or two to set up that generator and get it going. In the meantime, the batteries for the Trilogy, by the way, the battery for the Trilogy and the battery for our cough assist are the same. So we actually have three Trilogy batteries that supposedly have a six hour life. Uh, so we've got a fair amount of time that we could get things put together and we could run the generator to keep Christie powered. So emergency power supply is an important aspect.